Located next to Miami International Airport, George T. Baker Aviation Technical College is helping prepare its students for in-demand careers in aviation with courses from aerospace science to aircraft maintenance. My name is Gabriel Sosa and I'm taking the airframe course right now. The airframe course is basically everything except the engine. So you know, you have your wings, you know, your landing gear, the tires, the systems like hydraulics and pneumatic systems, you know, antennas, electronics, everything apart from the engine. My name is Ifani Ibena and I'm in the airframe program. Well, I've always uh, fueled planes at the airport. I did that for like five years, so while I was fueling the airplanes, so I kind of like developed interest in uh, working on the planes and trying to fix the plane, and uh, I think it's fascinating. I just thought, you know, you know, fixing the airplanes would be something, you know, huge and something I think I can do. And right now, you know, I'm on my way trying to, you know, get it done. My name is Kamisha Warren. I'm in the power plant course. It's basically pertaining to the functionality of a turbine engine or a reciprocating engine. It deals with the engine itself, making sure that it is functioning properly for flight. Baker Aviation graduate Carlos Gonzalez is now an instructor there, teaching students the skills they'll need for this rapidly evolving industry. From the time that I started in, in 84, so when I started, to now, it has changed dramatically. Everything that I have learned through my years of experience, some of it is not, not even being used anymore because the, the new airplane 787 is, is all completely changed. A lot of those systems are completely 100% different. When they first start with my classes, this is the first time introducing them to turbine engines especially. They come in and they're all like worry and stress. Oh my God, this class is gonna be impossible for me to understand. And then as we get them, it's like baby steps that we take through. And then by the time we get to the end of the class, I have like a personal interview with them. And it's funny because then they go, oh, but it's so easy, it was so easy. I go, yeah, it's easy now since somebody explained it to you and we went through the whole process, which, which in reality is not that difficult, but it could be overwhelming if you don't have somebody instructing you the, the proper procedures and the proper ways of doing things. I'm someone who likes to try new things. So I basically tried it out and it turned out to be a passion of mine. It's helped me with character development, discipline. So I definitely look at it as a blessing. Let's talk about the diversity of the student body because you have more females in the program now than ever before, right? It has increased incredibly in the past, I would say about three years. I've seen it go up. I would think right now we're running at about maybe 20% are female. And it's actually great that, that has, that's been happening because the industry is demanding more females. They're more attentive to detail. Mm -hmm. And this industry is all about detail because those are the things that actually prevent accidents from happening. In addition to its adult education courses, Baker Aviation provides dual enrollment classes for Miami-Dade County Public High School students, giving them a head start to a solid career. The advantage of having this type of program for high school students to be able to come here, uh, they don't pay nothing out of their pocket, everything is free for them, and by the time they finish high school, they could actually have a high school diploma and have at least partial certification, either a power plant license or an airframe license. That means they could actually start working in the field right away. And right now the field is actually acquiring a lot of these students. They're offering them 20 to $25 an hour. I mean, that's unheard of. Uh, that's really good money, for, especially for them, to help them with, you know, with their studies. If they want to go to college, they could actually help out paying for their college. Right now, for the major airlines, the average salary for top paid mechanic, which is usually takes about five to seven years, is over $100,000 a year. When they come here, it's like they want to be here. It's not like they're being forced to go. And even with the high school program, they, they come here and they, they express themselves that like they want to be here. It's not like, Mom, I got to go to school, I got homework. No, no, and here they, they love to come here. And that makes a big difference. It makes it easier on the instructors. It's, it's an incredible program. Mm -hmm.